What's up guys, welcome back to our channel. You know in the background we have our video that we just dropped. Today's Today August. guys. Today's what day? The 12th. Today's the 12th to yes. drop a video. Right now it's like 8, 8 something right now, right? It's so, 838 guys. So basically it's my side of her story time. Yes. And I have part 3 coming up next week. If, 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 if it's, much, it's enough views and People really want to watch it as soon as possible. I mean, it's already done. It's already it's already done editing, editing, and stuff like that. So if you guys want to watch it, you know, watch the video, get us the views, you know, get us like at least four hundred views. Like it, subscribe to us, and you know, share. It. And we drop part three next week. Yes. But another note. I mean, I don't know. I'm gonna put this in the video. Mm -hmm. I might I might put this in the video. Mm -hmm. You wanna put them down? Uh, sorry guys. He yeah. keeps crashing me. He got long ass. I'll say hi guys to the. So yeah, um, you know this famer is like, I don't know what to say, but I'm gonna say it. What? I'm just gonna say it. I'm not gonna start some shit, but I'm just gonna say like, oh, like, oh yeah. If people, if people, the things like with our story time is like, it's based on true scenarios. It's not lies. It's actually true. We, this YouTube thing, we're keeping it nothing but true. We're not gonna like fake nothing or like, you know, everything is true. Whatever, everything is real. You know what I'm saying? Yep. So. If people get offended or whatever, or they feel some type of way, you don't have to watch our videos. We're not obligated to watch our videos. Like, we will want you to watch the videos, but if you get offended, or you don't like it, you don't need to watch it, stuff like that. Like, you could just unsubscribe yeah, or I just don't watch like, it. I add up to that. Like, yeah. Because speaking of that, I remember we talking about that. So, yeah. therefore, like, you know, basically, like, the, like you know, we, basically about story time. Every time when we talk about story time and we, yeah. bring, we, we talk about, like, the problem we had with this type of people. Right. Like... If y'all tend to watch our video and stuff, you already know everything we're gonna say in the video is true and it's yeah, bad. True. We're gonna be honest. And if y'all don't like it, like he said, we're not making you watch your video. And it's like we're not gonna throw no shade or yeah. out there. We just being honest and how it went down, which mm -hmm. is true. Like anyone, even though people like even people we're not friends with, they might see it because you know, because right. we people tend to tell other people just right. that, like spreading around. So like all I'm gonna say is like if you don't like it. Just block us, don't subscribe to us, and that don't watch, and that's it. Because honestly, I don't want you to be texting us and this and that. Like, nobody's yeah. starting beefy. We're just being honest, and we're just telling how it went down. Please and thank you. Because honestly, yeah. if y'all don't like it, we're going to just tell you, don't watch it. Because don't, we don't want to repeat it to y'all right. over again, over again, over again. Just right. please, just like... Please listen to us. Just don't watch it or don't watch our videos at all. You can watch our video, but you don't watch videos like this, like yeah, story time. Don't, don't have to watch it. That's it. Yeah, I was gonna say point blank. Too. Like that's what we just trying to tell right. you because we don't want to be bothered by people texting us about this and this and that, like telling them, oh, okay, take it now. Okay, like can you like tell different ways to tell the story? Like no, like no, because it's like um the there's no other way. If, if, okay, this video in the past, the one mm -hmm. I did on your side. There's no other way to say because literally that's literally what happened. Like, if if it's like people want me to say like, oh, I hate like it's like they want me to make up lies and make us look bad. Yeah. It's like that's what they want. Like, like if I said like, oh, I spit on them, I say some racist stuff back to them. It's like that's what they want. But I'm we're not giving in. We're literally saying what we did, and that's literally what happened. Like literally what, what like literally what happened yes. and what occurred. That's literally all. Nothing else occurred. Like there's nothing that we did to them because we're not a problematic person. We don't really, we don't really like do do anything like bother people. Like like us. Like remember that happened. We were in we was ignoring them at one point. We let it go, but then it keep continue continue. Remember, it kept bringing us. They kept running their mouth, and that's when we like sorry because they were like I remember I told you like don't get them attention. Yeah. But yeah. So and then like yeah. Even though y'all say y'all support me, I, I appreciate it that yeah. like, listen, y'all can support me, support him, support both of us. Yeah. But like, if y'all don't like something, that just like, like he said, he said if someone that made a videos about us talking about the crap about us, <laughs> we wouldn't even care. We wouldn't buy right. like, okay, that's on you. That's you told your story. Great, perfect, bravo. Like you know, right. but just don't do the same thing with us. Like we know, and we're not trying to make no one look bad. Yeah, and that's what we're trying to do, especially like. That's Some, why we him, give them like, He's not trying to make no one look bad. Like right. he's just like telling his expression how it happened, how it went down. And literally what occurred, like nothing like, else. Just listen this video is this is gonna be a different topic, yeah. obviously. Yeah. So it's, this video is gonna be about It's basically gonna be like you know how to, um I mean last week we recorded or this um, week 
this week, right? I think it was last I, week. I, I see. Yeah. I'm confused. But yeah, I think last week we recorded the uh, college. I, I mean, well, he recorded. I mean, we both well, were saying what she was talking about. But he was explaining it. Yes. Yeah, um, so I was um, the college tip. So today the video is gonna be for you guys gonna be high school tips for freshmen basically high school trying freshmen. to survive high school yeah so basically you know we obviously been graduate high school whatever but yeah so it's a tip for you guys you know anyone who's a freshman out there gonna watch us or you know anyone if anyone randomly searches up all uh, high school tips they can come across this video or hopefully they do but like, yeah. for you guys but yeah we're gonna give you some tips yeah, yeah. The so the tip we're gonna like basically give you yeah, for freshmen and people who's like still in high school trying to survive is basically learn the school basically learn the whole entire building yeah. school like this and that and those yeah. that and also like challenging yourself yeah the challenge yourself is basically like you know pushing yourself um yeah pushing yourself like you know high school is different from middle school it's very different it i would say the work and everything is very different because i remember yeah, it was very different because when I was in high school, it was different. Not only because it's like a higher level, mm -hmm. but just amount of work and also just everything's different. You know, you're coming close to an adult and stuff like that. You're going close to college. You know, it could be stressful. High school is more stressful. stressful. No, it really is. Though. It is stressful, but college is more stressful, obviously. But yeah, push yourself, you know, challenge yourself, anything, you know. You know, like, yeah, I'm just basically. Um, get organized. Yeah, it's good to be organized, organized in definitely. high school. Not only just in high school wise, I but feel like, in your house too. Yeah, I was gonna say in, in general, be organized because like that's very important, you know. Also in your book bag too, cause yeah, cause it'd be out there. Like, I know you see many students come to class with their book, with their paper all yeah. unorganized, and, like I was never like wrap that. around whatever. I was never like that. I know people like that. I know some of my and friends. And especially teacher give you a lot of papers, and it's like yeah. you don't know what to do with them, but you have to keep them, but still keep them organized. Like y'all feel me, right? I remember there was a kid in my high school that he was doing something like that, and then the teacher would be like, "Oh, where's the homework?" And he will be like digging and digging, but at the end of the day, an hour. Minute. He, he just did that so like the teacher be like whatever okay i'll just give you an a but like he just did that. he just did no and then he, that, that's what he wanted to do like that's what he but hoped to get no because he didn't really have no i homework. mean that's not gonna happen like if you yeah. don't have the work how's she gonna grade it while seeing no work like where is the paper but yeah what is it uh connect is connect with so upper. your upper classmate yeah that just basically means like if you're a freshman like you know, I try to be friends with sophomores or juniors Junior. or seniors. Um, but you know what they be saying with the juniors and seniors? I mean, yeah, I mean, they, they think, and the seniors, they, my bad. Yeah, they be thinking whatever this and that, but like anyone like above you, like sophomore and junior, like try to, like, if you could be friends with them, be friends with them, you don't have to, but like, because they're good at giving advice, like anything, because you know, they're, they're no, not for level. Because I remember when I started freshman, I met some of this junior, sophomore and, and senior, they, yeah. they be like helping me out and giving me like advice what how to survive here and yeah. all this and pass with your class. So yeah. Yeah, pretty much. Um connect with others through activities. Uh yeah, you know like be productive. Like if you don't have nothing like you don't have nothing else going on like, if you're not working or like let's say you're not like taking care of your your mom or dad or your older siblings. Yeah something that you're not taking care of no one or you're not you have time. You know, join the club, join a club, join a chess club, or join a, you know, uh, a team in your school, like basketball, whatever you're Soccer, good at. Like any sport yeah. they have in there. Yeah, so, you know, connect, you know, make friends, you know, be productive. Yeah. Yeah, just, yeah. Because also, you with that, if you join, if you join like, any teams in school, also with clubs, you might get, like, some good benefits. You might, I don't know if you noticed, but, like, with those, you might get some benefits in college. Like, you might get some scholarships. Oh, yeah, true. And you know, and it's free money, so it was like free. No, it wasn't. So the other question is build relationship with your teachers and staff. Now this one you definitely have to, and so like it really is more important because if you don't, mm -hmm. like how are you gonna pass your classes? How, how do you know you're doing well in this and that in school and your life and all that? Right. So anything wanna add up to that? Yeah, it's good to like build relationships with your with your teachers and staffs because like you know. Also, be a counselor too. Your yeah. counselor, the most. It's good to like. You know, for the, and it's good for you guys, like, for them to know you and, like, you know, talk to them here and there, whatever, have a small talk. And, you know, stuff like that, just say hi, it doesn't bother. And also, it's good, you know, building relationships. Also, how many credit could, you have. Yeah, they yeah. can help you out of anything. They can help you, like, oh, like, 
and like, if you're not doing good in assignment or like, mm -hmm. something's going on, they can help you give you advice or they can give you extra credit or they can make you redo the assignment. Yeah, because I, I, I talk to yeah. a lot of my teacher and my staff and my yeah. mainly my counselor because I, I, she always been in my ass, I yeah. always been in her ass, basically be each other ass. And then that's the reason yeah. why I graduate quick in college with 44 credit because you know, you need. Yeah. I think so. And I know, and I think another state is different. Yeah, but in New York here, you need like 44 credit so, yeah. and stuff. So, yeah, but in college, I need like 107. No, credit. 120. 120 credit. So it's like a lot. But like for two years of my time, I need at least 60, 60. credit. But yeah. Next question. You want to read this one? Question. I'm like, this one. Make a visit. Oh, yeah, make a visit before school starts. Be sure. Um, be sure to attend your high school freshman orientation if, if there's one offer. if it's offered or if there's given yeah um yeah, yeah i feel better. like it's good because like no they provide you like the, the criteria of the yeah. school um what to expect and they're from they they, they they make you familiar with the school and stuff like they give you information history whatever and it's good you know it's good to like learn about the school and also like you know it's always good yeah. don't skip class Yes, oh my god. I skipped class. I, don't know. <laughs> I skipped class for like I, I skipped class for like three months for oh my god. You never month. ever ever especially y'all yeah, out there freshmen. Yeah. Don't especially y'all yeah, people who's a senior too, because you know I feel like everyone. Mm -hmm. But I feel like mostly freshmen and seniors the most because like you know they're about to get yeah. out and say yeah yeah last and and yeah and also freshmen y'all yeah, started it. Don't mm -hmm. ever, please, don't ever like we giving you this good advice. Don't ever skip because yeah. I did that, he did that, and it was not good. Yeah. It was not good. Trust me. Um, yeah. you wanna get that one? Do your best, basically. You know, always do your. I mean, it ain't not only just in school, but like you should always do your best in general. Because you don't. Because even let's say, let's say, let's let's just give. I'm just giving a scenario. Let's say you're playing with someone, right? And let's say that person is better than you in basketball, and. You're doing your absolute best, even though, like I said, you lose and stuff like that. You don't really lose because you do your best. So basically, you don't really lose. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So you lose if you give up. That's the only way yeah. you lose. Give up. But you never you give lost. up. Don't give up. Um, ask questions in class. You, yeah, yeah. definitely. You, sh I feel like it's important to always ask questions because if you're lost at some point, yeah. I feel like it's better not to stay quiet, stand there like a. Uh, a bunch of idiots and it's like you don't know what to do it's better to go yeah. to you and not only your teacher but to your classmates as well like oh like what did we learn today if did anything mm -hmm. happen oh what should we do and stuff it's better to always ask so you could keep on track and right. keep a track with your classmates as well like equal and so you could know in order for you to do well in class and pass all your classes but yeah yeah um learn to manage your time yeah manage your time just like i said in college it's good to have a flexible schedule, like you know when you go to school, when you're gonna study, when you're gonna be over, and when you have your free time, and then when you go to sleep. Make sure you manage your time. Make sure you have. I mean, you go to school. You most likely you're gonna start go to like you start school at eight o'clock to like three p.m. or whatever. Cause for me, it was definitely like eight fifteen, I think, eight thirty. Mine was the same. Mine was like eight o'clock to yeah. three o'clock, basically. Yeah. So basically, you know, make sure you're on top of your stuff, get your stuff done, don't procrastinate. Yeah. Um, write down all of your assignments. Yeah, that that's also like it goes along with being organized. Make sure you have like you have. For me, what I did, I had like a little notebook, and with that notebook, like I put like, oh, so you know, I got homework. Oh, for this kind of got homework. Oh, I gotta give my mom a paper, and then she gotta sign it. Stuff like that. I kept up with like you know like, um, I kept up with my assignments, and I kept up with anything I need to be done. And that's not only good in high school, but it's also good in the future. Like right now, you know, being organized and stuff like that, getting your stuff done. So yeah. Also like basically right here, is like basically make a do list. Yeah. So yeah, basically you should basically try to say like make a do list. So you can know all, each what you're trying to do for every mm -hmm. week, every day of your track to know. So create a comfortable, comfortable distracting, distracting free space. freestyle study space. Oh, um, basically, and the last one is communicate your schedule with families and friends. I don't know about that. Um, basically, but yeah. what if you're super busy in high school? You don't have very time with your friends and family. So I feel oh, like you should like also mm -hmm. like create a schedule. Not with just school, but with friends and family. Because you know how friends and family yeah. like, oh, we got. Can we go this? Can we go out? Oh, we gotta do this. Or oh, then you be like, yeah. no, mom or dad or friends. Like I got this time list to do. Yeah. And especially your person like to go outside. Like you're out person. Yeah. I feel oh, like yeah. you should do that. That's why. Yeah. Yeah, make sure like do that. Like, make sure like oh, that's you know, like all oh, at school. I can't go out.
them know in advance, like, oh, I'm gonna be busy this week, or let's say you have a test coming up, and you, like that weekend you need to study and stuff like that. Let them know, like, before you know, like, they make plans, like, oh, I can't speak, I got a big test coming up. Yeah. Always put your education first, first. in anything, because. I mean, no one wants to go. No one wants to repeat the grade, obviously, and no one wants to, you know, do GED, <laughs> or, or no one wants to, no one wants to fail that. Uh, no one wants to fail class. Summer school. We'll go to summer school. No one has time for that. So put yourself, put your school and education is more important than anything. Like, yeah, you don't really like when you're in high school. It's good to make money. But you don't really need a job at that age, like in high school, because even though like, some of them do work, because when I was high school, yeah. I was like I mean, I was sixteen. Working. I was still working during high school. I was working fifteen. Even though it was not easy, but I started at 16, but yeah. But I feel like, like, what every, like, I don't know, freshman or, like, everyone mm -hmm. in each class should know about is, like, like, be aware of that, the mm -hmm. group of friends change. Like, yeah. like make, manage your time. Don't be afraid to challenge yourself and stay focused on yourself and your goal, like you said. And mm -hmm. it's okay to do things by yourself, make plans with new people yeah. and stuff. Because, you know, you, you you might deal with problems and stuff. So yeah. I feel like you should not let that in your stuck to your head and let that get through you. Because like that means when you're going to, like, fall back with your education because you're too worried about the wrong thing. Mm -hmm. When you worry about the right thing, you know? Yeah. Like, especially if y'all want to, like, get out from high school, because I know y'all going to be tired. Like, y'all stay yeah. four years in high school, especially if at going to school at 8 to 3 o'clock in the afternoon, and it's, like, annoying. Like, trust me, I hated that, too. Yeah. But, like, that's the only way for y'all to, like, graduate on time, get get all your credit fast, and that's it. Like, basically, yeah. just don't follow the wrong step. We just follow the right step right there. Yeah. But, yeah, I think, like, that's, that's, that's all. I hope, like... This video help y'all out a lot out there, especially y'all people starting high school or y'all people who's doing high school manage trying to survive, trying to get out. Right. And also to the senior who's gonna be a senior this year, congratulations to all of y'all of 2023. Yeah. You know, but like I hope this help y'all out all out there. And you know, if y'all yeah. like this, give it a big like, so 60 like I guess and stuff. Yeah. But don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe of yeah. course and don't forget to mainly turn off your notification because yeah. that's the only way y'all could like know when we're gonna post a new video yeah. every day not every day but every once a week nah, like probably twice three times a week twice maybe. a week basically twice or three yeah. Times, yeah yeah but yeah guys i hope this video helped you you have anything to say yeah i mean not, not really just make sure to subscribe obviously you know guys <laughs> i keep seeing the same thing like I keep I saying know, it, but, but we have to say it. Plus, when we get new you, you um subscribers every yeah. every year or every month, no, we always got to Not every year, but every, every time year. we may get a new subscriber, we always got to probably have to say that to let them know, you know, because some people forget. And feels like you, you show me the amount of um percent. People that are not subscribed, yeah, that's a big percentage of you guys. Like thirty three, like that's crazy. I don't know, only thirty three of them are subscribed. No, like thirty three unsubscribe. No, it's thirty three subscribe. Seventy of them are not subscribe. Really? Yeah, I'm saying it's a lot. Oh my god! What like, are y'all waiting for? Like, that means that means like. Y'all not doing good. Look, cause things. Y'all not listening. What we All telling right. y'all? Think about it. So our first video has now like thank God like over 500 mm -hmm. views. Oh yeah, yeah, we hit like 517 views. Yeah. That's crazy. So, your first video. Thirty percent of people are like that video is like thirty percent of them are subscribed, and we have like 576 subscribers. Yeah, 576. So part of, like I don't know, like. I don't know, hundreds of them that watch there are subscribed, other people are, are not subscribed, so I don't know how. Are, first of all, I don't know how, those people that are not subscribed, how, I mean, they probably like from our, like from our social media or stuff like that, the people we know, or strangers. Why are you not subscribed? Your subscribe is not that hard. I don't you know? get it. It's like trying to say, why y'all look, it's like my Instagram story, but y'all don't follow me back. If y'all don't have, if, if, some stuff, yeah, either way. If the case, if the case is going to have a YouTube account, make one i mean yeah that's one thing it could be because you know to be honest with you i didn't have one but now i have one i'm gonna do them yeah make, i told him to make yeah. one i'm gonna make one for a while because she actually does watch youtube it's crazy she watches especially like, you watch youtube yeah. you like you get you use that uh, the apps a lot yeah you make a youtube account and yeah. stuff me i always had a youtube account because that was in plus you you know school also makes you have right. one